Welcome to my channel and thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I would also like to welcome Spirit into this reading and say thank you for the messages we are about to receive. This is a general reading. Okay, so you've got the battle card over here. So you are standing up uh, for yourself. There seems to be some kind of uh, issue that you have been facing and you've needed to defend yourself. So you're all up in arms about it, very defensive. There's some kind of scandal. So there has been some kind of gossip, some kind of drama that went on and you're having to deal with that and having to stand up for yourself. Maybe people said a lot of things that were n inappropriate and uh, or something that caused a lot of problems and now you're having to stand up and you know maybe defend your honor in that particular situation there's some kind of news coming in some kind of message coming in for you as well you've got the surprise card uh, you know some kind of communication coming in for you um, now, in the past, you've got that secrets. So uh, there were things that were going on around you in that si situation, in, I mean, in the office situation that you're working in, in your work situation, where people were keeping things from you and people were pretending to be friendly and they were not. So you were dealing with a lot of personality personality problems, people who had, um, you know, were not very, very supportive of you. And maybe very, very greedy people is what you've been dealing with. So people, um, you know, very jealous, very greedy, and this is why uh, this caused this kind of problem that happened. Uh, so going to the future, you've got reconciliation. So it looks like maybe somebody's going to bring an apology for you and try and make up uh, for any kind of bad behavior that they made, uh, they may have um, uh, displayed. So there's some kind of, you know, there has been a breakup of a relationship over here. There's been some problems, but there looks like there's some kind of reconciliation, some kind of apology coming in for you. Now you've got the troubleshooter card over here, and this is relying on your intuition um, to sort things out. This is even consulting the tarot if you need to. You can see she's got tarot cards in her hands over here. So you need to go by your intu intuition, go by your instincts in dealing with this particular situation and you know you'll be doing it um, following the right path if you follow your intuition so just use your um, you know your sixth sense to sort out this particular problem played by ear as they say so those are the energies for those two weeks so I'm just going to draw some cards from the tarot of new vision So the first card you've got oops, is the devil card. So there's something that's going on that's very negative within that work scenario that you're dealing with. Uh, you know, you might be dealing with a bit of a, a person who's a bit of a bully. The devil is usually somebody who bullies you, uh, you know, uh, somebody who bosses you around you're feeling very tied up very chained there are things that are being hidden from you as well with the devil over here um so somebody is really jerking your chain and they're doing it behind your back you can see these people are tied up in front of that devil so a lot going on behind the scenes that you're not aware of somebody's manipulating the situation in quite a toxic kind of way and uh, you know the negative the energies are pretty negative you're dealing with somebody who's maybe very two-faced about things they're doing things behind your back and you don't even realize that they're doing it so they're manipulating the situation to serve themselves and not in a good way and it's about control and they're trying to control you within that particular situation now you are defending yourself so the previous energy cards showed that you know you were standing up you had that battle card over here and this you've got the seven of uh, wands over here so having to defend yourself against people who are really all up in arms against you now you are you've got the higher ground over here but you are dealing with a lot of people that are causing a lot of problems you've got all this cloudy smoky kind of things going on over here around you and all these people bringing these wands up against you and you're having to to stand up and defend whatever happened now you are going to be um, you know a winner in that particular situation you have people that are supportive of you this is the three of cups and this is like a card of victory of celebration of something good happening so even though you're defending yourself in the situation it seems like there are people that are supporting you and you will be victorious in this particular scenario
And what's happening with you in the past year? You've got the King of Pentacles. So you've been very, very focused on your work, very focused on your job. You've been sorting out problems. You've got that man uh, taking that bull by the horns and somebody who is very much in charge of that situation. So you've got quite a high management position and you are sorting things out. Uh, you know, you have taken control. You are managing things quite well. And, you know, um, you're managing resources pretty well. Um, and, you know, you are uh, pretty high up on that uh, career ladder at the moment. You've got the king, a queen of swords over here. So you're pretty determined to get things done. Uh, so whatever you're doing, you know, you're speaking your truth. You are not taking any nonsense from anybody else. And, you know, um, maybe this is a bit of a lonely job uh, because, you know, the queen of swords is generally quite a lonely figure, but her word, uh, you know, uh, carries a lot of weight. And so you are sorting things out, you're getting things uh, sorted out, and you're a very determined person. Um, and nobody messes with you, in other words. So, uh, you know, uh, you don't brook any any kind of, uh, you know, uh, dissension, if you like. Um, and, um, you know, you are, um, you're very, very truthful, very, very honest, and you get the job done as well. And it's also a job that involves a lot of communication. And you're pretty, uh, you know, balanced um, and, um, you know, uh, you, um, your rule, rulership is very uh, honest and very fair. Uh, and maybe this is the reason why people are trying to trip you up. Now you've got some, you might be considering taking on a new job or, or considering getting a, a new post. So there might be a new job offer that comes in for you that you are considering. And this job, um, you know, this offer is going to bring in a lot of success if you take it. So, you know, it, it opens the road up for you. You've got that big cost in the background over here and this offer being made to you. And this is something that you're being, you're considering. It also might be a promotion that might be coming in for you as well. But maybe because you've got so much of drama going on uh, around you with this devil card, there might be somebody who's trying to control that circumstance or that situation, giving you a little bit of grief over there or, or manipulating you a lot and you're having to defend yourself all, all the while. Uh, you might be actually thinking of taking on this new post or taking a new job. Definitely there's a new offer that is coming in. So this new job is going to bring in lots of new money, but also this new uh, this new offer, it's a new enterprise coming in. And there again, there's the castle and a lot of stability coming in for you. So there are, you know, this offer is, it looks like it's a very firm offer. It's a very good offer and it's going to give you a lot of power and authority. And it is something well worth considering taking if you're, if you have that opportunity being presented to you and it looks like you are going to take it because you're leaving things behind all the drama all the problems behind you're leaving these swords behind and you're taking your expertise and moving on with the seven of swords towards that castle so you are going to be taking this new offer that comes in you are definitely making plans on moving on you're definitely moving on. You've got the Emperor card over here. So the position that you're going to get is going to be a position of authority. You've got a lot of power over there with that eagle. There's a lot of communication. So, you know, and you're going to be in charge of a lot of people. Uh, and it's going to mean also that you may have to move home. You've got that tortoise with his home on his back. So you might have to move home as well uh, to take on this particular new role. But it's going to give you a lot of um, authority. Uh, you might fly away. So it might be something... Uh, job that you do overseas you've got that eagle over there so something that has a lot of authority uh you know and it's going to use a, a lot of your intellectual power and prowess uh but it might mean might mean that you travel away from there so you know something that involves flight something that involves you know air travel uh in other words and you might move home to get that particular job so and it's going to bring in a lot of money and a lot of authority and you've got the nine of um that way, sorry. <laughs> You've got the nine of um, swords over here. So this is being very, very anxious about it, you know, uh, being kept up awake at night, worrying about whether or not you should take it. So you are really, uh, you know, you do want to make this move, but you are very, very anxious about whether you should make it or not. So you've got this uh, Knight of Swords over here, the High Priestess over there, and the Wands, um, Three of Wands. So with this Knight of Swords, there's still a lot of drama going on. There is somebody that there is causing a lot of problems for you. This could be waiting for some kind of legal decision to come in with the uh, Swords cards. It's always about legalities or official decisions, signing new contracts or moving on very, very quickly. But this is this is also about dealing with very, very difficult people, people who stir up problems and that could be that devil person over that causing a lot of problems and you know causing a lot of drama causing a lot of fights arguments uh you know um really um trying to get uh um, you know manipulate you into doing something that you don't want so they it's either waiting for some kind of legal decision to come in and that will come in soon 
um, or uh, dealing with somebody who is very, very difficult, uh, a very, um, um, you know, a person who causes a lot of upset. And um, and you've got the high priestess card over here. So, um, you know, there are secrets. Whatever this person, this Knight of Swords brings in, or whatever this brings in, it's going to reveal a lot of secret, uh, something. It's going to reveal something very important to you. Because you can see the Knight of Swords bringing in that sort of truth and this veil falling away to reveal the owl. So some kind of information is going to be revealed to you. And it might not be something that you really wanted to hear. It might be a little bit of upsetting news that comes in over here. A bit of truth that comes in that you didn't expect uh, and it's definitely been hidden from you for a long time and maybe once you see that truth or you realize the truth of the situation you decide that you're going to move on so uh, you know you're, you're making that decision about whether or not to take this job but definitely whatever this news is going to that comes in it's very upsetting it, it brings in a, you know a lot of energy change over here um, you know makes things very very difficult it's it's um you know but um the news um causes a lot of drama in itself uh, but it reveals a lot of secrets to you and once you get that um you understand that that cycle ends and it seems like you will take your things and move on and it does look like you're going to be moving home as well. You can see all these wagons going off uh, and this person uh, venturing out. And whatever job you're going to be doing, it's going to be something international, dealing with a lot of people on an international basis, but leaving that old job behind and moving on. So it looks like there's a big change coming in for you here. And it's coming in quite quickly. And, you know, you are going to be making that shift, that move, leaving behind things that are not serving you, leaving those swords behind, those troubles behind, taking your skills and moving on into a better position. And you've even got that tortoise over there that is showing about a, something about a home move. So whatever this new job is, uh, you know, eventually it's going to bring a lot of success that comes in over here. And it's going to put a lot of authority back in your hands. So you are being faced with a very challenging uh, position right now. And you are making a big change as well. So the first card is the Four of Summer, which says uh, being distracted and failing to see the magical opportunity. Uh, taking someone or something for granted, discontent with life now there is that opportunity being offered to you so you've got these two cards over here about the ace of coins the ace of um, rods and this is the four of some of that opportunity being offered to you uh, and so it is you know then this opportunity with this four of summer might also involve further education or even uh, teaching uh, uh, some kind of mentoring role as well involved as well as work so this opportunity is being offered to you and you should really be taking it uh, and moving on from that particular drama that you're going through right now you've got the sun card over here which says plans that work out perfectly amazing ideas um, that lead to rewards and com commendations gratitude for the blessings of life so you know you will be able to overcome obstacles this man is jumping over this wall over here uh, you know and um, it looks like you will be successful so this is something the sun card brings in all that energy and brings in all that success but you need to you know it, there's a lot of work that's going to be involved in this new job um, but it will bring in a lot of awards uh, rewards and a lot of recognition as well and the ten of autumn which is the uh, ten of pentacles the end of that work cycle so it looks like you are going to leave this old job that you're you're doing right now there's too many problems in it and take share, steps to ensure financial security of your children and loved ones making wise investments or planning for retirement honoring family traditions now with the 10 of autumn it's always about you know leaving that old job behind getting some kind of payoff from it and moving on to a new cycle the 10 of uh, autumn comes before the ace of pentacles or the 10 of pentacles uh, is you know the card that precedes the ace of pentacles so ending that old cycle and starting something brand new and it bringing in a lot more money or financial rewards but by ending this old job there's some kind of payoff um, that you get from it some kind of settlement as well and you will Will move on and the job that you move on to is going to be quite successful because you've got the sun even though it involves a lot of hard work because the sun card is always about hard work long hours it's going to be something that pays off so this new opportunity that comes in with this four of summer this new offer is a good one and it looks like you know it's going to bring in a lot of success and recognition um, and you will get a payoff from this old job uh, something some extra money coming in as well and it will allow you more freedom, this new job as well. And, uh, you know, you'll be dealing with a lot more people on a, a, a bigger, a broader uh, scale, a um, more international uh, community that you will be dealing with. So some truth coming to light that you not 
um, the best of things that you want to hear, but it allows you to move forward. It will make you, uh, you know, you'll make your, your mind after that and then move forward. So I hope this reading has resonated with you. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, leave me some comments, and don't forget to watch my energy remedy videos that I have put out. Uh, thank you for watching. Take care now. Goodbye.